How's it going? So today we're going to be talking about manipulating the oxidation state of the permanganate ion. So in front of me, I have four different beakers that have purple solution of the permanganate ion. Um, this first beaker we're not going to do anything with. It's just going to be the reference beaker just so that we can compare it to the rest of them. So as we manipulate the different oxidation states with the following reactions, we're going to see some color changes. Okay, so the first reaction we're going to be doing is we're going to be putting some hydroxide solution and some bisulfite in the permanganate ion, and that should give us a green color. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate that for you. You can already see it starting to change color. And there's that green color we're looking for. Okay, so that's the first one. Okay, so what we did there was we changed the permanganate purple ion and we changed it into the manganate ion, which is green. So we went from the oxidation number plus seven to plus six here. Okay, so the second demonstration we're gonna be doing is we're going to just be adding bisulfite to our permanganate ion solution, okay? And what we should end up with is a brown, kind of cloudy solution. Um, and what that cloudiness is, it's that's, that's a precipitate forming. And that precipitate um, is what's making it cloudy. But over time, that should settle at the bottom of the beaker. And uh, the solution should be a little bit clearer. So I'll go ahead and demonstrate that for you. start to see it change into a kind of a brown color here. And it's a little bit cloudy. I don't know if you can see that, but but there we go. Okay. So, for that reaction, we went, and had, we went ahead and went from the plus seven oxidation state to the plus four oxidation state. And you can see this brown kind of cloudy solution here. Okay, and then for the final reaction, what we're gonna be doing is instead of adding base like we did for the first reaction, we're gonna go ahead and, ahead and add acid along with the bisulfite, okay? So that should give us from the purple to a colorless solution. start to see the color disappear and there we go so for that reaction we went ahead and went from the purple to the colorless again and we went from the plus seven to the plus two oxidation state